Okay, you guys, I have made it to the table. Like Saudi say, my mountain had kind of like still, so I had to get it back together. So, y'all, I don't know how I'm going to bite this, but look at it. Okay. Do I even got it on right? I don't think I got it on right. Hold on. I think I need to twist. I don't know if it matters or not, but it might it might help it out. Seems like I got all the stuff need to slide to the Yeah, I got a whole lot of mint. Um uh cream cheese. That's what she put on it. I like cream cheese, you don't know. But I, I, I ain't never had it on no sandwich, though. Okay, y'all. Dun, 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 dun. I need a piece with the bacon. Yeah. Um, you probably got it with bacon. Huh? You probably got it with bacon. I got two pieces on there. It's dripping. Y'all, this is interesting. This is, um, I don't want to bite enough. Mmm. Y'all, this is very interesting. <laughs> I need to slide everything over. Y'all, it's a lot it. It tastes really healthy. Um, despite all this meat I got on here. It still is like, um, like refreshing. Y'all, I be piling stuff up. I know y'all know that by now. This look a mess. <laughs> no. I haven't tasted a pickle yet. I think I put too much stuff on mine. <laughs> <It's tight>. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can just have uh, some meat too. Mm -hmm. Help that pickle back down. Mm. It's like... It's, it's like... It's like a, a sub sandwich, no bread or something. You know, a huge sub sandwich, no bread. And then you, you can't really taste the light. If you don't like cream cheese, you can't really, it gives it, it makes it not dry. No. I ain't mad about, um. Adding a pickle instead. 
Because I want extra pickles on my sub sandwich anyway. If I remember, I get extra pickles. Sometimes I get cucumbers and pickles sometimes. Y'all, yeah, it's different. Uh, my bedroom, go home. Yeah. I need to put on sour because I ain't known that way. I have found some, but I think I threw them away. Like some that was with, a, um, with food. When I used them in my other video, I think I threw the ones away that I didn't even use too. So, uh, excuse me. I think. I have to look at my video see that I use my. <laughs> Y'all heard them look. It's bad. <laughs> It was messy, but it wasn't as messy as mine. I added more I, more stuff. So, hers was a little bit more uh, under control than mine. Y'all. Look at all this sandwich. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Y'all, you, you have to be careful with, you know, you know how you think grown people, <clears throat> you know, like, it's okay for your kids to be around grown people. Some of them, it, it ain't even okay for some, for your kids to be around some of these grown folks. And it's sad, you know what I mean? But if you think about it, we don't know how our grown people are raised. So, it could make you live in your child with somebody that got some sense. If your child might have more sense than the grown person. Um... I didn't even realize that. I think that you said not leave your child around that person anymore. You know what I mean? Some adults are discouraging. Just think if, if y'all know that and you leave your ch child around them. It's bad enough that someone have to deal with it with their peers, but then to be around an adult that's this girl, and it's like, what in the world? What do they do? You know? Like, like you know who? Probably. Mm-hmm. That you know made that comment when you when you oh no stop that's not wrong I didn't talk about what I didn't talk about that's not wrong that would trip me out hard I'm gonna say it gonna say it gonna say it but I just said I'm saying I'm wrong but adults some of these adults and then it's like if they make that wrong move in front of the parent or another adult, it's like you have to think real fast so that you won't get locked up. You know what I mean? Because I 
If you think that was your child, and you done witnessed an adult out of line with your child, you could lose everything at a drop of, of a dime. If you beat him up, hurt him, anything like that, your whole life can change just because this ignorant adult. So, <clears throat> you have to stay aware, <clears throat> excuse me, of these grown people as well. Not just, not just, um, they peers. Or, not really people of their age. Because I mean grown people. They be jealous of kids too. Some of these grown people jealous of, of their own kids. And that's sad. You know what I mean? That's real sad. A man and an adult jealous of their own child. Can you imagine that? Mm. Oh, you got, uh, uh, you got him? Those three days, they be on that titty. I'm sorry. They could be grown, they child could be grown. They still jealous of them. Yeah, you know, when I say child, I'm saying that because it is their, 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 their child. You know what I mean? And you know, like, it would be so long, like, you know, okay, so they just are their own child, and like, they could really start doing stuff to their child, like, dressing them a certain kind of way. Or like doing they hell a certain kind of way because they jealous of them. You saying good or bad? Bad. Well, it's wrong think about you too. <clears throat> they could not care how they dress. Like if they dress like a grown person. And they only right. Is they jealous or are you saying regardless of what this is? Well, I guess that wouldn't be jealous, but it would be something where like you dressing your child grown and they only like ten. Mm -hmm. That means all the adults gonna be paying your child some attention. Like all of it is wrong. I don't, that probably is like not jealous, but I don't know what it is. It's something it's something mentally. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or they, just don't care. Mm. or they just don't care. No. There's a lot of people like that out there. A lot. A lot, a lot. Y'all, look at this. I done got down to the nitty gritty of this. Oh, yeah. No, no. You ain't, you gonna be cool. You cool? I'm like, what you gonna ask me? I want some ice cream? No, what? Why you more that fool? Oh, because you know, we were just talking about if you go oh, uh, cause it ain't got that much meat on it. You know, I was saying cause it's like, like more of a healthy, like it's, yeah, you know, got, yeah. I mean, I it's, it's I might you know eat an ice cream later, but I don't think I'm gonna be like oh oh I got fruit in there, some cherries. I can eat ice cream. You know how I have to wait on ice cream. <laughs> That's why she eat light over there so she can double up on the ice cream, y'all. No, because I got to save myself for the ice cream, like. Caught her early in the morning. You ain't caught me. I <laughs> asked you when I there and caught you. Caught her at. Six o'clock. Six o'clock. She ain't caught nobody. With a big old ice cream she cone, y'all. She ain't caught <laughs> No, no, no. I'm look. like, what? No. Can I say the whole story? <laughs> Can I say the whole story? I don't care. Okay, so like she was at her friend's house, and like the garage was like I hear the garage opening because it's so loud, and like I didn't see her car pulling up or nothing. She, I opened she, up up the garage before I was like right right up she, on the house. She go she gonna say oh I opened it up at the stop. I who opens up the garage at the stop sign when 
a dick or in the garage. <laughs> a deer? A rat or someone's cat or whatever. A deer, bro? Somebody. But I go down there. I own the dog. I walk. She walk in. I'm like, oh, you just scared me. You like open up the door. Yeah. Like, we both open up the door at the same time. Like, she was pushing in and I was pushing out. Now, the moral of the story is, why you have ice cream at 6.30 in the morning, because 6 o'clock? I, I, I had got done doing the dishes and I needed, uh, the, I needed to treat myself. <laughs> <laughs> she needed to treat herself for washing the dishes. Yeah. And wiping the counter and sweeping the floor and all that. Oh, excuse me. Now, that made me feel so much better. Y'all, this was actually good, y'all. It's like, um... It's like something you can eat for lunch. Um, if you like trying to eat healthy, you know what I'm saying? It's something. I guess you would probably use less cream cheese, you know what I'm saying? If you want to be more on the healthy side and less meat. You know what I mean? But um, I, I, I like it. You know what I'm saying? It's something that I would probably do again, you know? And you can tweak it to your liking. Because I added things that she didn't, you know what I mean? And and I really like it, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm. And something else you also did that I'm gonna try. Um she used to be love sauce too. So with her leftover sauce, she gets some linguine noodles, she cooked them, and she put the rest of the sauce over the noodles cook them in the noodles and it looks so good she tore it up and she added sausage to it no that sounds good so she added sausage to it and i'm like that is a good idea because sometimes i have like a little bit of sauce left and it ends up getting thrown away because it's just a little bit that could be you know you can heat it up and add the, the, the noodles to it and i think that would be real good Add them sausages like she did. I'm like, um, she gave me some good ideas. I'm like, is she getting this off from TikTok? Do I need to get on TikTok? I don't know where she get it from. She probably already just know how to cook like that or try different stuff like that. But that was a real good idea. And I'm going to try myself with leftover sauce, leftover be love sauce. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that was a mess. <laughs> and I ate it all. And now, y'all. Um, no. Um, You're going to be on that toilet. <laughs> Go in your bathroom, mama. She's going to be on the toilet. Go in your bathroom. I'm human, ain't I? Go in your bathroom. That's what I'm saying. Anywho, I just want to say thank you guys for tuning in to meet your girl, Miss Awesome Lawson, also known as Mama Mario. And you guys, you should really try that bell pepper sandwich. And thanks, lovely Mimi, for giving me the idea. Peace out.